Hey, this is Robert with Clean Pool and Spa. And in this video, I'm going to teach you how to take your total alkalinity in your swimming pool using your K2006 pool water test kit. Now, if you don't have this kit, I suggest that you get it because it's going to give you the most accurate readings. Okay, so I'm going to come down here and open it up. And for the alkalinity, you're going to be using these three bottles. And if you get... Uh, uh, if you don't really understand what's going on, up here gives you the directions and they're color coded. Okay, so first thing that I'm going to do is take the vial, I'm going to hold it straight up and down, go into the water up to my elbow and then flip it straight back up again. That's going to give you the most accurate reading. You, what you don't want to do is this big windmill thing because it looks impressive but it's useless and it does nothing. Okay, so come down here, go straight in and then come straight back up again. Now, you have these markings on here. These are the mils, the 25 and the 44 mil. What you want to do for, for the alkalinity is hit the 25 mil. Um, but you have a full vial of water right now. <clears throat> so what, what you can do is instead of just flicking the water out, trying to get the 25 mil, uh, just going to tilt it out. And if you watch the water right here, once it gets down to this 90 mark, which is right there, right at the bottom of the thing, and then you hit the 25 mil mark, okay? It's a very easy way to do that. So I'm going to come over here, and your first dropper is going to be the theosulfate. This is R00007. And you hold the vial like this and the dropper straight up and down and I'll put five drops in. This is a chlorine neutralizer. One, two, three, four, five. All right. And then swirl to mix. Now, when you swirl, do not hold it like this and slosh it around. That does nothing. Also, don't hold it up here and just go back and forth. It does nothing. What you want to do is you want to get that nice circular motion going like this, okay? That's a good swirl, all right? So we're gonna swirl to mix. And then the next one is the alkalinity indicator. That's a R0008. And if you see here, you're gonna see the actual swirl. I'm gonna swirl the water, and you wanna get that nice vortex going in here. So I'm just gonna swirl the water, and I'm gonna put five drops in. Again, hold it straight up and down. One, two, three, four, five. And you can see it's kind of going around. That's what you want. And the alkalinity will obviously turn, turn green. Uh, that's my phone. Turn that off. All right. Bad timing, huh? Next one is the R0009 uh, sulfuric acid. So what I'm going to do, in fact, I'm going to turn my my phone off. Okay, this is a sulfuric acid. Now, what you want to do is we're not dropping down here. You hold it right up at eye level, and this is going to go from green to red with each drop. Okay, so hold straight up and down and swirl and just so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and probably the last one will be eight. Swirl. All right. And that goes to red. And so what you do is I put in eight drops, multiply that times 10, and that's 80. So I know that this pool, the alkalinity is 80. Uh, and it's that easy. Don't pour it back in the pool. Just pour it over there and rinse your vial out and you're set. So that is it. And that's how you take your alkalinity using the K2006 pool water test kit. Uh, like, subscribe, comment. Uh, please check out the description box. Uh, it has a link to my video, or a link to my website, cleanpoonspa.com. Lots of great information over there. So thanks for watching. I hope this helps out. Be safe and happy swimming. Bye.